Well, gift cards are, of course, a convenient and popular option for all the holiday shopping you're probably doing. But they come with some potential gotchas. Sean Lewis has a story of a church's gift card giveaway gone wrong. Yeah, gotcha, gotcha. Gotcha, mm -hmm. gotcha. It is a lesson in reading the finest of fine print, even when you think that it's a simple transaction, right? Buying a gift card. A church in Orland Park bought 130 of these gift cards from Sam's Club online to give away to those in need. Simple enough, sure, until it's not. The victim are these, are these kids. Less than a week to Christmas, Pastor Steve Trollio is trying to solve an expensive problem that began when his small congregation at the Firehouse Chapel gave big to buy $13,000 in Sam's Club gift cards for those in need. Do you see the vein in my neck sticking out, Sean? It, it just walks. His mission started last month when Steve went online to buy cards, 130 of them at $100 each. They arrived in the mail. His daughter checked. You get the envelope. It's a brown, uh, just sealed envelope. And there's 10 Sam's Club cards in there. No paperwork, no receipt, no nothing. They're just it, thrown in the package. That's it. So she called Sam's Club or did it online or something through a chat. And they said, oh, no, you're all good. You, okay, well, there's nothing on the cards. Nothing at all. The cards were not activated, something they only learned after the families they gave these cards to began to try to use them last week. But they're standing there knowing that somebody gave them a gift card and there's nothing on it. And what they had in their cart, they got to they got to put back. Ugh. that makes me that makes all of us sick to our stomach. Believe me. Pastor Steve, his wife, his daughter tried to sort it out. Calls to customer service last week, they say, got them nowhere. I, I told the girl the other day, she goes, we really care. I go, <laughs> I go, you don't care. You're a multi-billion dollar company. You can care less. $13,000 to you guys is nothing. I said, but to these kids, it's something. To our church, it's something. And, you know, they're messing with God's money, not, not mine. And But they're messing with God's children. That. That bothers me. And when you go online, you find that Pastor Steve is not alone. Several reviews on Sam's Club's own website with warnings of mailed gift cards purchased online. There must be a glitch in the system, but their activation system doesn't work, one reads. Another, there was no indication when I purchased that it needed to be activated. And a deeper dive on Sam's Club's website does give this guideline. If purchased online, you must activate the card using the related shipping confirmation email. Once activated, take the card to any membership desk to activate. We see an embarrassment time and time again, especially when you give cards for the holidays. Steve Burness from the Better Business Bureau here in Chicago says you must read the fine prints. Because of the world we're living in today, because of the scams, because of the theft, there's a lot more uh, you know, policies and procedures put into place. And as consumers, the Better Business Bureau suggests you ask ahead of time, not after. Sam's Club is promising us that these are going to be activated, but I don't got a good feeling. For Pastor Steve, it is a test of patience as he navigates trying to get these cards activated for these families before Christmas. We're real passionate about kids and helping families and people, and that, that just got us. You can mess with me. I don't care. You mess with kids? We got a real problem with that. It's, it's sad. We reached out to Sam's Club to get some help on this matter. We're waiting to hear back ourselves, but I just talked with Pastor Steve within the hour. There's some good news. They've made progress. Some of those 130 cards are now activated, just not all of them, at least not yet. He's literally praying mm. that all of them are active by this time tomorrow so those families can use them before Christmas. All right. They've got a few days left. Yep. Thank you. Great story, Sean.